Hello everyone and welcome to our channel RTFI Pro. Today's topic that we'll be discussing is the welding discontinuity slag. Slag is a non-metallic solid inclusion either linear or rounded, which becomes trapped within the weld during the welding process. Slag is produced from insufficient cleaning between weld passes, low amperage, improper welding, or when attempting to weld in an area that is too tight. Slag inclusions. Slag inclusions are often more irregular than the circular porosity and can be in many different shapes and sizes. Slag inclusions are often linear and elongated with the length of the weld and frequently seen in multi-pass welds as cleaning between passes has not been adequately performed. Evaluation tips for rounded slag inclusions. Density of slag inclusions are typically lighter than porosity. When indications are round and satisfy the definition of rounded indication, length is equal to or less than three times its width, as per ASME codes, it shall be evaluated as rounded indication. Evaluation tips for elongated slag. Elongated slags are evaluated based on size, quantity, length, and width. Slag lines can be confused with incomplete penetration or lack of fusion, as in some cases they are very similar in appearance. A key point to remember in these situations is to look at the density of the indication and the direction. Slag lines in most cases will be more irregular than lack of fusion or incomplete penetration, and the density will be lighter. And in most cases, the slag indication will not have a straight appearance as lack of fusion or incomplete penetration. Well, this concludes our topic for this week. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Until next time, work safe and expand your knowledge for an increased reliability of inspection.